someone trying to block you or trying to get you cancelled for a social media post that was mm-hmm. uh, that was a while back, and um, like I got told what the post was, mm-hmm. and I was like, "Fuck, really?" Like that—that's what you get cancelled for. Sure. Like what I heard, what it was was it was a photoshopped head of you on some big jacked up dude, and it said, "What do you do if this guy slaps your girlfriend on the ass or something like that?" Is that what the post was? Yeah, I think or it was. I think it, oh, I think, I think it was just a picture. I think it was just a picture of me. I don't think I was photoshopped on anyone's body, okay. but that's what that's what it that's what it was. Yes. Yeah. So yeah, you're you're a jacked enough cunt without having to do that shit. Okay. Cool. I get, yeah. it. I get it. The post went up. It was up for a couple of days. It was up for a couple of days. Sure. Um, no issues, and then it was a couple of people saw it that, um. Took, I was say took offense to it, but would just like saw it a certain way, and that's not like that's if that's the way you sort of see it, that's that that's okay, like that's okay on your end. Um, I took down the post. I apologized for it. The post was sent to a particular wrestler, and then they made a public post about it. They contacted me in the morning. I didn't see the post because i was just, i did sorry i didn't see her message because i was asleep um and then i didn't get a chance to respond to the message from that particular person who just sort of addressed what i posted and stuff and then they made went and made a public post about the they went and made a public post about sorry sorry i already deleted it they yeah. contacted me um I didn't have time to sort of because I was asleep um, to respond to them. They already made a public post about it, um, about what I posted. Um, I went, I I responded to the to the I responded to the person that um, messaged me and sent the public post. Um, we had a bit of um, contact back and we had a bit of contact back and forth. Um, mm way of like you know like i'm i'm very sorry if you i'm very sorry if um you know if if you like if the if you found this really offensive i do i do apologize it wasn't the intention it's just you know it's something lighthearted. it's not meant to be like a a stab at it's not meant to be like a stab at like at a like oh i hate yeah it's not like no like not like (laughs) at all it's like do, like domestic assault is like you know, it's like one of the most like disgusting like, just lo- just oh, low oh, things oh, that oh, someone oh. like someone that can do like, it's like, you know like, you for like forcing yourself upon like forcing yourself upon someone is like, just so disgusting like just such a disgusting sort of thing, um, sure. like we had this private conversation about the what happened. And I thought, okay, we're all we're all good, like. And then, of course, she kept the post up. We're still going back and forth, like the girl. Oopsie, um, everyone knows it anyway. I was not yeah. going to say the girl. Um, and I mentioned about how, like, I had my own like incidences of like being groped, like, and not sort of you know, not walking it, welcoming it, of course, by certain people in wrestling. Um, and I mentioned that to her and said, oh, hey, like, you know, like I've been, you know, I've been, you know, I've been groped. I've had like comments uh, like, towards me from certain people that I haven't invited. Um, but I brush it, I brush it off because it's just, for me, that's just how I just handle it. Like I'm not, um, sure, sure, sure. I can, I can laugh and I brought that up to, I brought that up with her to say, hey, you know, like there's no, like there was no malice behind the post or anything. And then she kind of like, I mentioned what happened, like the stuff that's happened to me. Um, It's like people that, you know, are sort of in the wrestling sort of scene. And then she pretty much just brushed it off. And it was like, oh, you posted posted that. You posted that. So I don't give a fuck about what any of the stuff that happened with you. Um, and it was at the same time that 
that was all happening. I was getting people that were like messaging me, like that don't follow me, of course, um, saying, oh, that was really poor form. I was getting people commenting on stuff of mine, especially like the apology I did that were saying, I didn't see the post, um, but I accept your apology or your post didn't seem very sincere. I didn't see, I didn't see what you posted, but um, where I was getting people harassing me and like commenting on stuff that they never seen, they didn't even see the post. And so yeah. I felt horrible because I'm getting, I'm getting like, I'm getting this image of me as in like, something that's like I put like I've put like that I posted something like unbelievably horrible that I should be, you know, exiled. I should be like, I should be done. Like I should be, you know, I should be fired from my job. Like I should be, you know, blacklisted from wrestling. Um, so, I found that it was I struggled with it because I felt that so many people judged me and they had no context of they had no context where they had some people. Then there was other people like if they saw it a certain way, like I had conversations with people and they said, um, you know, explain the situation to me. I understand. Um but I had people, I had that going at the same time, but then I had a lot of people that were messaging me um, saying, oh, hey, bro, we still support you. Like we, That's you know, cool. like, like they said, bro, when like, you know, you're still, you're still part of our family um, that, you know, you, you yeah, we'll never kick you from shows. And it was really, there was only like one place that sort of um, kind of didn't welcome welcome me sort of back. And then I, like, I, like, I, like I had people unfo like unfollowing me, um, which is fine. Everyone unfollows everyone on socials. But then I was getting people like that were giving me bad reviews on like my, my Facebook page because of it. And I don't even know if some of those people even saw the post, um, but it was That's crazy. they were jumping. Just, on, they were jumping on that, and there was maybe like one person that I kind of responded to that, you know, um, that messaged me privately and sort of said, "Oh, that's poor form," and I kind of snapped back and just said, "Oh, okay. Did you see the post, the original post? Did you see my apology?" Um, and I explain all the stuff and, you know, then I said, oh, you didn't? Okay. And then I end up blocking them, which was probably, I just should have, I should have left it at the time. Um, yeah. But it's, it's one of those things where there was 99% support and then there was like kind of like a 1% of sort of Fucking people that were kind of, yeah, like there was yeah. people – like on the post that the person did, I had a look and then saw the, the people liking it and I was like, okay, like, okay, no worries. Like I guess we won't be sort of, you know, you we won't be friends. We won't be friends anymore or like there was so – like, yeah. it's, it's so nuts. Like the, yeah. this social media mm. – Craze that people sort of go on and jump on and and all that. It, it's just so ridiculous. But yeah. I want to take you back because you did say mm. something there that I want to ask you about. So you said mm. you were groped and you said you had advances mm. made. Were these made by women, men? Like where and when? Of course, I don't want to name names or anything because I'm not. I don't want to like. I'm not trying to ruin people's lives and stuff. Like, um, the like there was like this one person sent me like, which I think at the time I shouldn't have done, but in like I spoke to people about how there was a particular wrestler that sent me a picture of their asshole without. 
actually like that it wasn't welcomed at all on my end. Um, I thought you were going to say wasn't was, clean, but yeah, I, anyway, I don't anyway. know. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't stare. I didn't stare into it, but. But, but it, Jesus, but, uh, someone sent you a yeah. photo of their fucking ass hole. Yeah, but Damn. but there's, but like Jeez. there's the thing of, but there's the thing of like I don't like I don't like it's, I don't, I don't get like really, I don't take that sort of stuff to heart. Like it's just I, no, you know, no, you I'm go. Just, I, I'm yeah. not saying like you have to take it to heart or take yeah. offense to it. I'm just saying it's a yeah. fucking pretty wild thing for someone to just yeah. go. I don't, uh, dude. I don't know. Maybe yeah. I'm just fucking mm. old time. Maybe I'm an old timer. Yeah. Maybe I'm just old. But man, like to s- just go, mm. hey, there you go. Check out that. Check yeah. out the stuff. You know what I mean? Like that's kind of yeah. fucking weird, bro. Like that's yeah. odd. It, I think, like it's yeah. There was other stuff. Like I had people that I did wasn't really that keen. Not that keen. I wasn't. I found that I was uncomfortable in a certain way of like how friendly sort of like people, like a certain, like a particular person was with me, like friendly as in like touchy, touchy, um, like sitting on my lap, sort of like, fr- like friendly. And like, I brought, like I brushed it off. Cause like I said, I hey man, like, I think I said, I know you're a little bit old, like you're a little bit older than me, but like, I'm, you know, I've come from the nineties where, you know, that sort of, like, if anything happens, like, you just brush it off or you just go, okay, that was a bit weird, and then you move on. Like, um, where stuff is sort of, like, stuff that's happened to me um, where I could go, oh, I should remember, I should, <laughs> is Dave, who the f- oh, they could release, oh, f- Jesus Christ, Dave Fattenbrough. 